So good evening, everyone. This meeting is a virtual meeting as authorized by New York Executive Order 202.1. The public is participating via Zoom, which is muted. The meeting has been advertised on the city's website and notice of which has been posted. The meeting is being recorded and will be made available shortly afterwards on the city's YouTube page, which is available at www.youtube.com and searching or, or searching for City of Glens Falls uh, and, and searching for City of Glens Falls, excuse me. If you wish to participate by making a statement or asking a question, this is people other than the council members, uh, please wait until the mayor opens the meeting for public comments. You should raise your hand or your virtual blue hand, which is at the bottom of your screen somewhere. I haven't found mine, but I guess that's because I'm the administrator. <laughs> and uh, simply raise your hand or until you receive a text message stating that you'll be called upon in the order in which you have signaled the meeting administrator. Votes will be conducted by roll call. And let's start the meeting by just taking the roll call attendance of the common council members participating in the meeting, if you will, please, uh, Bob. Um, Councilwoman at large Reed. Here. Councilman Campanell. Present. Councilman Collins. Here. Councilwoman Palmer. Councilman Clark. Here. Here. Okay. Mayor, take it away. All right. What happened to Scotty? Scott is, uh, he is not going to be able to make it tonight. He's gone horse for some reason. Um, I don't know if he was yelling during a football game or what, but <laughs> okay. he, uh, he is in, um, He's in quarantine. Oh, that's right. I forgot. Yeah, so that. he's at home. So he uh, he texted me and said he would not be able to come. So we will um, we'll start our meeting, and we're going to start with the pledge of allegiance that I will lead us with. Here's the flag. Ready? I pledge allegiance. Pledge allegiance to the flag, flag. Of the United, United States, States of America, America. And, and to the Republic. Republic. Which is one nation, one nation uh, under God, God indivisible, indivisible, with liberty, with liberty justice, justice for, all. for all. All right, that's always fun with. Uh, Man, that's going to make time. some. I can make that more you know, fun next time. I'll have a video a eventually. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Will that be in our next year's record album? Maybe the Christmas yeah. uh, record yeah. album? Yeah. Yeah. It could be. Sold at fine clerk's offices everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> so we always start our meeting with uh, public comment. So if there's anybody on a Zoom meeting that would like to uh, make a comment, you could raise your hand at this point or you could wait to the end of the meeting. So if Peter sees anyone, uh, please identify and, and bring them in. Hey. Okay, no one, Peter? Oh, yeah. Okay, so we'll go to uh, committee reports and we'll start out with um, Ms. Reed. I have none. All right, Mr. Campanell. No report. Mr. Collins. The sustainability committee has, has been meeting. We don't have much of a report for you. We are continuing to meet uh, regarding right now. Um, well, we have the good news that our lights are are coming to Glens Falls in a, in a, a storage unit near you. So uh, we probably will be waiting until the, um, until the, the uh, weather gets better for the actual installment, but the LED streetlights have been purchased and are on their way to Glens Falls. So that is, that is great news. And we are continuing to meet um, regarding uh, also our urban uh, green initiative and progress is being made there as well. Okay. Congratulations on that. I know you've done a lot of hard work. Um, I'll say go to Ms. Palmer. Uh, building and codes hasn't met, but our public hearing was moved to the next council meeting. So we We'll um, have that in two weeks. Okay. On Thank our you. proposed fee. Just... Okay. Mr. Clark. Our uh, the police reform committee will be meeting on Thursday to discuss the proposal 
um, in the survey uh, that we did. Um, and hopefully, we'll have something to you guys uh, in the very near future. It's at a public for review. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Under a uh, voice vote, Power on. Is, uh, we'll go to voice vote. Number one is a resolution approving the minutes of December 22nd, 2020 meeting of Glen Falls Common Council. Two is a resolution Power approving on. December 2020 monthly report of the city clerk parking violations bureau. Three is a resolution recognizing January 22nd, 2021 as Solomon Northrop homecoming day in the city of Guns Falls to commemorate the 160th anniversary of his regained freedom from slavery. Is there so a moved. motion to approve? So move. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Is there anything under roll call vote you would like to pull for further discussion at this point? Number four is a resolution approving grant award for case file 2018 homes uh, 021 in connection with the city of Glens Falls home ownership program in the amount not to exceed $24,000 subject to the home buyer acceptance of the final mortgage commitment issued by primary lender and acceptable to the city of Glens Falls. Five, a resolution approving grant award for case file 2018 home 014 in connection with the city of Glens Falls home ownership program in the amount not to exceed $24,000 subject to home buyer acceptance and the final mortgage commitment issued by primary lender and acceptable to the city of Glens Falls. Six, resolution approving community development manual payments of $17,786.07. Seven, a resolution authorizing controller to transfer $51,000 from 2020 general fund expense line a six seven one one zero dash four four five nine forestry service to twenty twenty one general fund expense line a six seven one one zero dash four four five nine forestry services eight is a resolution authorizing a controller to increase twenty twenty general fund revenue line a zero zero nine 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 dash twenty six thirty restitution by one hundred fifty six dollars and ninety seven cents and increase twenty twenty general Fund expense line A23120 4315A police clothing uniform supplies by $156.97. Nine is a resolution authorizing mayor to enter into a renewal agreement with countryside veterinary practices for impoundment services of lost or stray dogs pursuant to the schedule detailed on the attached. 10 is a resolution declaring the Glens Falls Assessor shall extend the 2020 exemption status for those individuals receiving the senior exemption and the persons with disabilities and limited income exemption through 2021 with a renewal application, except in circumstances where the assessor believes that an owner that qualified for the 2020 exemption has since changed their primary residence, added another owner to the deed, transferred the property, to a new owner or died. 11 is a resolution declaring the Glens Falls Common Council as lead agency for seeker review of proposed Glens Falls downtown connector pin number 1761.88 and further authorizing and directing the city engineer to send a copy of the short environmental assessment form part one presented at this meeting along with a certified copy of this resolution stating that the city's intention to be declared as lead agency to any and all communities or agencies that is necessary to give written notice to, it, to in accordance with New York State Municipal Law, including New York State Department of Environmental Conversation, New York State Department of Transportation, New York State Canal Corporation, and New York State Office of Parks, Recreation, and Historic Preservation. 12, a resolution approving an encroachment permit for First Light Fiber, Inc., 41 State Street, 10th floor, Albany, New York, is approved by Mayor Hall on December 21st per city code 189-19B, subject to review by Common Council to place a 30-foot wooden stub pole on the north side of Elm Street on the southeast corner of 29 Elm Street to connect the Verizon poles on the west side of the parking lot to allow First Light Fiber Inc. to place new aerial fiber optic cable and subject to seven stipulations by the city engineer as listed on the attached. 
13 is a resolution approving the war. We also have um, some addendums. The first one is a resolution rescheduling a public hearing for 7.25 p.m. Tuesday, January 26, 2021 via Zoom regarding the proposed fee schedule for building code administration related permits and authorizing the city clerk to make public notice of said public hearing a proposed fee schedule. And the next supplemental is a resolution uh, approving a CDBG emergency housing repair grant in the amount of $4,250 and accepting a proposal for the repair work by Kelly Constru Construction, a participant in the city's rehab program. So moved. Is there a second? Second. Okay. We'll call vote, Bob. Ms. Reed. Yes. Mr. Campanell. Yes. Mr. Collins. Yes. Ms. Palmer. Yes. Mr. Clark. Yes. Hey. Oh, hold on. It's Ron Newell, our attorney. <laughs> Hello, sir. Wrong address. <laughs> Uh, all right the heck with it so i'll go to old business miss reed i have none all right mr campanel nothing here mr clark i just want to thank the mayor and the council for approving a resolution number 11 that was a pretty big mouthful for the mayor to say but um, uh, being the lead agency to put two pedestrian bridges over the Cedar Canal, connecting Water Street to the canal and connecting um, Prines Island uh, of running along the bridge so um, pedestrians and bicyclists don't have to go over the bridge with trucks. Um, it's exciting. Um, there's, you know, to connect that area of the city and, you know, bring it to, um, bring it to, um, you know, Murray Street and up, up Murray Street when we do the bike lane up there and then bring them into um, South Street, and Broad Street and downtown. It's just exciting. And I just want to thank you guys for helping it come to fruition. It's really, it's a really important project and something I thought um, a lot about and it's just exciting. And uh, so thank you very much. Okay. New business, Miss Reed. I have none, sir. All right. Mr. Campanell? Just to uh, say, um, I hope everybody stays safe. And I got a call the other day from um, about the vaccine from Glens Falls Housing Authority. They wanted to know if I was still interested. I said, absolutely. So they will contact uh, public health. And then at some, some date, don't know when, didn't even bother to ask, but they will contact the county and then we'll find out. So, hello? 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 Yes. Hey, is that Ron? Hi, Ron. <laughs> Welcome, Ron. I'm not You're doing a green well telephone, here. Ron. Looking <laughs> good. You're there. That's good. We missed you. Okay, well, so who are, are we? Are you all done? No, we're still going. We're doing we're right, doing well, uh, new business and it's uh, Bill Collins's turn. All right. Well, Liz is coming over to help me get the thing running on the computer, but so far I can't figure it out. <laughs> yeah, we'll we'll get it straight for next meeting. All right, go ahead. Bill uh, Collins. I I just want to uh, thank you, Mayor, for your announcement and Jane uh, for your announcement yesterday. Um, I hope we have a great year and. And thank you for your service, all your leadership uh, and all we've been able to accomplish. Um, I just can't say enough. Thank you. And um, both of you, I really do appreciate it. Yeah. Thank you, Bill. Uh, Ms. Palmer. Well, I wanted to uh, thank DPW, particularly Rich for uh, getting the pond open. It's uh, being lit and we're asking for for night skating it's being lit and we're asking that people wear masks and just use common sense about social distancing so that we can keep it open and stay safe and everyone can enjoy skating um, and then i also wanted to thank you 
mayor for moving forward with the tree inventory. I see that we had a, a resolution regarding tree planting um, funds on our on our agenda, and I think that's really exciting for the city too that we're going to finally get our tree inventory taken care of. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Yeah. So that is for the uh, tree inventory and a tree plan from a company called the Davy Group. And we'll be meeting with them soon. And as I mentioned to you before, uh, Councilwoman, that I'll make sure you're invited to that meeting. So, yeah, thank you. Okay, Mr. Clark. Well, you you know, um, I got to echo Bill's comments. Um, you know, it's eight years has been it's been wonderful and a lot of memories. And you know, I don't want to get emotional, but you guys have been wonderful friends and. It's been awesome, and uh, I just, you know, I love you both, and I wish you well, and all that wonderful stuff that comes with walking away from City Hall. <laughs> so God bless you both. Well, thank you very much. Yeah, we got a lot to do here, so yeah, I was just gonna uh, say, we, we got a year. Yeah, we do. People, we got a year. It's, it's gonna be it's a busy year. Yeah, we've we we've, we've got some work ahead of us. Probably. Yeah, we do. Um, I, it just, and I'm happy that we can do it together. And, yep. um, you know, it's, it's been wonderful working with you both. So, a lot of wonderful memories. Thank you. Well, it's been a, a difficult year with, especially with the uh, pandemic and a lot of the things that have happened here in the city, but we've uh, weathered through them and, uh, you know, we'll continue on. As I mentioned, we'll work, try to work as hard as we can to, you know, get as much done as we can by the end of the year. So um, is there anyone from the public that would like to raise their hand That'd if they want great. to make a comment? I don't, don't make difference. No, that is, it's fine. I will make one statement that uh, we were, people were asking about the little hand. It's at the bottom of your screen in the reaction section. Yeah. Uh, and you see a little place where it says raise your hand. Uh, you? We have that many people that need to worry about her right now, but uh, in the future. Okay. They're looking for your glasses. So there's no one that wants to make a comment? I don't see any. Okay, so then I'll look for a motion to adjourn. So move. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All right, we're, we are adjourned. Thank you. Kudos to the drive home, everyone. Right. Jim, Jim, are you uh, Jim? Are you in in the Bay Area or what? I, I, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I've got a lot of support out here for people who want me to jump. But <laughs> all in favor? All right. <laughs> great. Oh, man. Right, we'll see you. So Please, thanks for Thank you, Peter. Thank, thank you, Peter. Thank you very much, Peter. Nice.